Do you ever feel like everyone's judging your every move? Let's dive into Stoicism and explore how to stop caring what others think. Focus on your values. Imagine a life where your choices resonate deeply within you, where external noise fades away. That's the power of living in alignment with your values. These core principles like honesty or adventure are your compass, guiding you towards decisions that bring fulfillment. The first step is introspection. Ask yourself, what truly matters to me? What kind of person do I want to be? These values become your guiding light. They help you prioritize your time, energy and resources. This can be tough. Not every opportunity or relationship aligns with who you are. Releasing the inauthentic can feel scary, but it's like clearing the path for something better. Remember, letting go of what doesn't serve you creates space for what truly does. Focusing on your values isn't about becoming rigid, it's about living intentionally. When your actions align with your core beliefs, the opinions of others hold less weight. You become less susceptible to peer pressure or societal expectations. Living your values is an ongoing journey, but with each aligned decision, you'll feel a deep sense of purpose. You'll be living authentically, attracting experiences and connections that enrich your life. So, embark on this journey of self-discovery. Find your true north and let your values guide you towards a fulfilling life. Self-acceptance. Imagine a life where you don't feel the need to be perfect. That's the gift of self-acceptance. It's about embracing all of you, the strengths you celebrate and the quirks you sometimes hide. It's knowing you are worthy of love and respect, just as you are. Self-acceptance isn't about complacency. It's the foundation for growth. When you truly accept yourself, weaknesses become areas for improvement, not sources of shame. You can celebrate your strengths while acknowledging areas to develop. This journey starts with self-compassion. Talk to yourself like you would a friend. Acknowledge your struggles and celebrate your victories, big and small. You are worthy no matter what the external world says. Think of yourself as a beautiful mosaic. Each tile, your strengths, weaknesses and quirks come together to create a unique and valuable picture. Accepting each piece allows you to shine your full light. Letting go of the need for external validation is liberating. When you accept yourself, the opinions of others hold less power. You become free to be authentically you, attracting genuine connections built on shared values, not a need to impress. Self-acceptance is a lifelong practice. There will be bumps along the way, but with each step towards self-love, you'll feel a deep sense of peace. You'll be living authentically, attracting experiences that enrich your life and radiating confidence from the inside out. Embrace your whole self. That's where your true beauty lies. Opinions are subjective. Opinions, inherently subjective, are colored by individual experiences, perspectives and biases. What someone thinks or says about you often reveals more about their own worldview and personal lens than it does about your actual character or worth. Understanding this fundamental truth can liberate you from the grip of others' judgments and expectations. When you recognize the subjective nature of opinions, you gain a newfound sense of freedom and autonomy. You no longer feel beholden to others' perceptions of you, realizing that their views are but fleeting impressions, not immutable truths. Instead of internalizing external judgments, you can choose to cultivate a deeper connection with your authentic self, rooted in self-awareness and self-acceptance. Embracing the subjectivity of opinions opens the door to empathy, and understanding. Just as your own opinions are shaped by your unique experiences and perspectives, so too are others. By recognizing this shared humanity, you can approach interpersonal interactions with compassion and openness, knowing that everyone sees the world through their own lens. In essence, understanding that opinions are subjective empowers you to reclaim ownership of your self-image and navigate social dynamics with confidence and grace. 
By freeing yourself from the need for external validation, you can cultivate a deeper sense of authenticity and fulfillment in all aspects of your life. Set boundaries. Imagine a life where your energy isn't constantly drained. That's the gift of setting boundaries. These are clear lines around your time, emotions and resources, protecting your mental and emotional well-being. Learning to say no to requests that don't align with your values is key. Boundaries aren't walls, they're healthy fences. They create a safe space for you to thrive. Identify areas where you feel drained or disrespected. Are you constantly pulled into negativity? Do people make unreasonable demands on your time? Setting boundaries addresses these issues. Saying no can feel uncomfortable, but it's a powerful tool. Use I statements to communicate clearly. I can't help you today, or I'm not comfortable discussing that. Don't feel obligated to explain or apologize. Setting boundaries isn't selfish, it's self-care. When you prioritize your well-being, you have more to offer yourself and those you truly care about. Imagine a garden overflowing with beautiful flowers. Boundaries are like the fence. They protect the garden, allowing it to flourish. With clear boundaries, you control who has access to your energy. You attract healthier relationships and create space for things that truly matter. So take a deep breath and prioritize yourself. Learn to say no with confidence. Setting boundaries isn't about shutting people out. It's about creating a safe space for yourself to bloom. Power of why. Criticism, like a pebble in your shoe, can cause discomfort. However, stoicism encourages you to delve deeper with a simple question. Why does this bother me? By exploring the root cause of your reaction, you can transform criticism from a source of irritation into a tool for self-discovery. Imagine yourself standing before a mirror, but instead of your reflection, you see the source of your discomfort with criticism. Often you'll find it's not the criticism itself, but a fear or insecurity it triggers. Perhaps it highlights a self-doubt you harbor or a past wound it reopens. Identifying this underlying cause empowers you to address it directly. Questioning your reaction to criticism fosters emotional intelligence. By understanding why something bothers you, you learn to differentiate between valid feedback and baseless negativity. This allows you to respond thoughtfully, focusing on addressing genuine concerns while remaining unfazed by irrelevant barbs. Furthermore, using why fosters self-awareness. By uncovering the fears and insecurities triggered by criticism, you gain valuable insights into your own vulnerabilities. This self-awareness empowers you to address these underlying issues, promoting personal growth and resilience. Remember, criticism isn't always a personal attack. By questioning your reaction and identifying the root cause, you take back control of your emotions. This allows you to approach criticism with a discerning mind, using it as an opportunity for self-reflection and growth, ultimately leading to a more robust sense of self. The paradox of approval seeking. We all have a natural desire for approval, a primal urge to be seen favorably by others. However, stoicism presents a paradox. The relentless pursuit of universal approval is not only unattainable, but also potentially distracting from a more fulfilling path. Chasing universal approval leads to frustration and disappointment. There will always be those who disagree with your choices or simply don't understand your perspective. This relentless pursuit can compromise your integrity, forcing you to conform to external expectations rather than living authentically. Instead, Stoicism encourages you to prioritize the respect of those who share your core values. These individuals, whether friends, family or colleagues, appreciate your genuine self and support your choices when they align with your principles. This fosters a sense of belonging within a community that values the same things you do. Remember, true fulfillment comes from living authentically according to your values, not from seeking validation from everyone.
By focusing on earning the respect of those who truly matter, you cultivate a sense of inner peace and integrity, empowering you to live a life true to yourself. Separate fact from fiction. To thrive in a world abundant with opinions and feedback, it's essential to sharpen your ability to distinguish between constructive criticism and baseless judgment. Constructive criticism offers valuable insights and opportunities for growth, while baseless judgment serves only to undermine your confidence and hinder your progress. Constructive criticism typically comes from a place of genuine concern and a desire to see you improve. It is specific, actionable, and delivered with empathy and respect. When faced with constructive criticism, embrace it as an opportunity for self-reflection and personal development. Consider the feedback objectively, identify areas for improvement, and take proactive steps to address them. By doing so, you can turn criticism into a catalyst for growth and success. On the other hand, baseless judgment lacks substance and is often rooted in personal biases, envy or insecurity. It may be vague, unfair or delivered with malice. When confronted with baseless judgment, it's crucial to recognize it for what it is. Noise. Refrain from internalizing unfounded criticism or allowing it to diminish your self-worth. Instead, cultivate resilience and confidence in your abilities, knowing that your value is not determined by the opinions of others. By learning to separate fact from fiction, you empower yourself to navigate feedback with discernment and wisdom. Embrace constructive criticism as a tool for growth and ignore baseless judgment as irrelevant noise. In doing so, you can cultivate a mindset of continuous improvement and self-assurance, enabling you to thrive in both your personal and professional endeavors. Focus on yourself. The human desire to please everyone is strong, but Stoicism offers a liberating truth. You can't please everyone. This doesn't imply indifference to the needs of others, but rather an acceptance of the reality that trying to constantly win approval leads to inauthenticity and misery. The pursuit of universal approval is a recipe for misery. There will always be those who disagree with your choices and trying to constantly win them over is an exhausting and ultimately futile endeavor. It leaves you feeling unappreciated and resentful, hindering your ability to pursue your own happiness. Stoicism encourages you to prioritize living authentically according to your values and principles. While being respectful of others, you don't need to bend over backward to win their approval. This approach fosters a sense of inner peace and self-respect. You are free to be your genuine self, attracting those who appreciate you for who you truly are. Remember, the path of authenticity may not always be popular, but it leads to a life of meaning and fulfillment. By focusing on living in accordance with your own values, you cultivate a sense of integrity and self-respect, paving the way for genuine and lasting connections with those who truly matter. People are busy with themselves. In the throes of self-consciousness, it's easy to believe everyone is scrutinizing our every move. Stoicism offers a liberating perspective. Most people are busy with themselves. This doesn't imply a lack of empathy, but rather an acknowledgement that others are likely preoccupied with their own anxieties and concerns. Imagine yourself attending a crowded party. You might be worried about a perceived flaw in your outfit. However, from the perspective of others, they're likely caught up in their own conversations, worries and self-perceptions. Your flaw is likely a blip on their radar. Understanding this principle can alleviate social anxiety. When you recognize that others are likely not dwelling on your perceived shortcomings, you can relax and be yourself. This allows you to connect authentically and engage with others with greater confidence and ease. Furthermore, this perspective fosters compassion. By recognizing that everyone has their own anxieties and insecurities, you cultivate a sense of shared humanity. This allows you to interact with others with understanding and kindness, fostering more meaningful connections. By releasing yourself from the self-imposed prison of self-consciousness, 
you empower yourself to engage authentically with the world around you. This opens doors to deeper connections and a more fulfilling social experience. Cultivate grace. In the complex tapestry of human interaction, Stoicism highlights the importance of practicing graciousness. This encompasses extending kindness and appreciation towards others, recognizing and valuing their contributions to our lives and the world around us. Being gracious starts with cultivating a sense of gratitude. Instead of viewing life's blessings as entitlements, we can choose to acknowledge the efforts and contributions of others, both large and small. This appreciation fosters a sense of humility and a deeper connection with those around us. Graciousness also manifests in our actions and communication. It involves treating others with respect, consideration and kindness, even in challenging situations. By choosing our words and actions carefully, we can demonstrate empathy and understanding, fostering positive and meaningful interactions. Furthermore, practicing graciousness encourages us to be generous with our time, resources and support within our means. Whether it's offering a helping hand, listening with an open mind or expressing genuine concern, these acts of generosity contribute to a more positive and collaborative environment. Ultimately, practicing graciousness serves as a catalyst for positive change, both within ourselves and the world around us. By extending kindness and appreciation, we inspire others to do the same, fostering a ripple effect of compassion and understanding that can transform our communities for the better. Develop thick skin. In the arena of life, negativity can be a constant barrage. Stoicism teaches you to develop thick skin, a resilience that protects you from emotional harm, but with a crucial caveat, not a callous heart. This means learning to deflect negativity while maintaining your capacity for empathy and compassion. Imagine yourself as a seasoned warrior. You wear sturdy armor that protects you from physical blows, but beneath it beats a strong and compassionate heart. Similarly, a thick skin shields you from the emotional barbs of negativity, preventing them from wounding you deeply. Yet, your empathy allows you to understand the struggles of others who might be wielding those barbs. Developing a thick skin fosters emotional resilience. You learn to deflect negativity without taking it personally. This allows you to maintain your composure and focus on what truly matters, preventing negativity from derailing your goals or happiness. However, a thick skin shouldn't morph into a callous heart. Stoicism emphasizes the importance of maintaining empathy. By understanding the potential causes of negativity, such as someone else's own pain or insecurities, you cultivate compassion. This allows you to respond with understanding rather than anger or resentment. Remember, a thick skin is a tool, not a transformation. It empowers you to navigate negativity without succumbing to it, while your compassionate heart allows you to connect with others on a deeper level. This balance fosters inner peace, resilience, and the ability to build meaningful relationships in a world filled with both challenges and opportunities for connection. Learn to say no. Learning to say no to requests that conflict with your values or deplete your energy is essential for maintaining your well-being and preserving your authenticity. When you establish clear boundaries, you honor your own needs and priorities, and you send a powerful message to others about your self-respect and self-worth. By saying no to requests that do not align with your values or goals, you protect your time, energy and resources for the things that truly matter to you. It's important to remember that setting boundaries is not selfish, it's an act of self-preservation. It allows you to maintain your integrity and prevent burnout, resentment and overwhelm. By prioritizing your own well-being and honoring your limits, you create space for growth, creativity and fulfillment in your life. Setting boundaries may feel uncomfortable or challenging at first, especially if you're used to saying yes to everything or putting others' needs before your own. However, with practice, it becomes easier to assertively communicate your boundaries and advocate for your own needs and priorities. Practice kindness to yourself. 
In the rush of daily life, it's easy to forget the most important person, yourself. Yet true joy and resilience blossom from a foundation of self-compassion and kindness. Imagine a close friend going through a difficult time. You wouldn't belittle them, but offer understanding and support. Extend the same courtesy to yourself. Treat your flaws and shortcomings with patience and forgiveness, just as you would a friend. Acknowledge that mistakes are inevitable and embrace them as opportunities for growth. Celebrate your progress, no matter how small, and recognize your efforts. Instead of harsh self-criticism, speak to yourself with the encouraging words you'd offer a loved one. Replace negative self-talk with affirmations that highlight your strengths and value. Indulge in activities that bring you joy and nourish your well-being. Celebrate your small wins and acknowledge your efforts. Practice mindfulness to observe your thoughts and emotions without judgment. Remember, you are worthy of love and kindness, just as you are. Embrace self-compassion and watch your inner strength blossom. Self-compassion is a source of strength and resilience. By caring for yourself with kindness, you cultivate the inner peace and confidence needed to navigate life's challenges with grace and courage. Power of Authentic Expression Imagine a world where your quirks and passions aren't hidden, but celebrated. That's the magic of expressing yourself authentically. It's about ditching the masks you wear to fit in and embracing the unique you. Sure, there's a pressure to be someone you're not. We all want to be liked and accepted, but constantly morphing for others is exhausting and robs you of your true connections. People are drawn to genuine personalities, the ones that radiate confidence and individuality. Think of your favorite artists, musicians, or even friends. They resonate with you because they bring their whole selves to the table. They're not afraid to be silly, passionate, or even a little weird. That's what makes them magnetic. Expressing yourself authentically isn't about being obnoxious or inconsiderate. It's about honoring your values, interests, and sense of humor. It's about sharing your opinions and letting your quirky laugh shine through. The truth is, the right people will love you for who you are. They'll appreciate your unique perspective and infectious enthusiasm. So, ditch the people-pleasing act and step into your authentic self. The world needs your spark. Shine bright. Practice forgiveness. Life is inevitably riddled with hurt, disappointment and conflict. Holding on to resentment towards ourselves or others, however, only burdens our spirit and hinders our ability to move forward. Stoicism emphasizes the importance of practicing forgiveness, a powerful tool for releasing negativity and finding inner peace. Forgiveness isn't condoning wrongdoing or erasing the past. It's a conscious decision to let go of resentment bitterness and the desire for revenge. This process allows us to heal emotional wounds, move forward with our lives and foster healthier relationships. Forgiving ourselves is often the most challenging part. We may hold on to guilt, shame or self-criticism for past mistakes or shortcomings. However, forgiveness allows us to acknowledge our errors, learn from them and let go of self-punishment. By embracing self-compassion and acceptance, we pave the way for personal growth and self-forgiveness. Forgiving others doesn't imply overlooking their actions or diminishing the harm caused. It's about releasing the negative hold those actions have on us, choosing not to be consumed by anger and resentment. Forgiveness allows us to detach from the negativity and choose a more peaceful path, free from the burden of bitterness. Practicing forgiveness doesn't guarantee reconciliation or forgetting the past. In some cases, maintaining distance or setting boundaries is necessary. However, forgiveness allows us to detach from the emotional baggage and choose not to let past experiences define our present or future. Holding on to anger and resentment is like carrying a heavy stone on your back. It drains your energy, hinders your relationships and prevents you from experiencing joy and peace. By choosing forgiveness, you release this burden and free yourself to experience life more fully. Ignite your fire. Life's too short to spend it on autopilot. There's a wellspring of joy and fulfillment waiting to be tapped. Your passions, 
These are the activities that set your soul on fire, the ones that make you lose track of time. Don't relegate your passions to the dusty corners of your mind. Dedicate time to nurturing them. It could be anything, painting, rock climbing, writing poetry, or volunteering for a cause you care about. Every bit counts. Think of it as an investment in your happiness. Immersing yourself in your passion sparks creativity, reduces stress, and boosts your overall well-being. It also opens doors to new experiences and like-minded people who share your enthusiasm. Here's the beauty. Pursuing your passions doesn't have to be an all-or-nothing proposition. Start small. Maybe it's carving out 30 minutes a day for photography or joining a weekend pottery class. Every step forward adds fuel to your fire. Remember, your passions are more than just hobbies. They're a reflection of who you are and who you want to become. So, unleash your inner artist, adventurer, or whatever ignites your spirit. Pursue your passions and watch your life transform. Help others. There's a profound satisfaction in reaching beyond yourself and making a positive impact. Helping others isn't just about charity. It's about connecting with a cause you believe in and fostering meaningful connections. Contributing your time, skills or resources to a worthy cause allows you to be part of something bigger than yourself. Whether it's environmental protection, animal welfare or social justice, your efforts can make a real difference. The best part? You'll find yourself surrounded by like-minded people who share your values and passion. Volunteering or working on a common goal fosters a sense of community and belonging. You'll build friendships, learn new skills and gain a fresh perspective. Helping others isn't about being a superhero, it's about starting where you can. Maybe it's volunteering at a local shelter, donating blood, or simply being a supportive friend. Every act of kindness ripples outward, creating a positive chain reaction. By lending a hand, you not only enrich the lives of others, but you also enrich your own. You'll experience a deeper sense of purpose, connection, and satisfaction. So, find a cause that ignites your compassion and step into the role of a helper. You might just discover your new tribe and a more fulfilling way of life. The power of imperfections. We all stumble. We make mistakes, have quirks, and sometimes fall short. But here's the secret. Those imperfections are what make us human, and embracing them is the key to a lighter and more fulfilling life. Society often bombards us with images of perfection, leaving us feeling like failures for not measuring up. But the truth is, Striving for flawlessness is a recipe for stress and disappointment. Instead, let's reframe imperfections. They're stepping stones, not roadblocks. Each mistake holds a valuable lesson, a chance to learn and grow. Did that presentation not go as planned? Maybe next time you'll practice more or try a different approach. Embracing imperfections also frees you to be your authentic self. It allows you to laugh at your quirks, share your vulnerabilities, and connect with others on a deeper level. People are drawn to genuine personalities, not airbrushed facades. Remember, some of the most inspiring stories come from overcoming imperfections. The artist who perseveres despite rejections, the athlete who bounces back from injuries, the entrepreneur who learns from failed ventures. These are the ones we admire, so the next time you feel like you've messed up, take a deep breath. Accept the imperfection, learn from it, and move forward with kindness towards yourself. You'll be surprised by the strength and resilience you discover when you embrace the perfectly imperfect you. A journey, not a finish line. Stoicism teaches us that life isn't a race to a finish line, but rather a continuous journey of personal growth. It's the process of learning, overcoming challenges, and developing our character that holds the true value, ultimately leading to a state of inner peace. Imagine a wise elder, their face etched with the lines of a life well lived. Their wisdom isn't the result of a single achievement, but of countless experiences, both joyful and difficult. Similarly, on our own paths we gain wisdom and resilience through the challenges we navigate and the lessons we learn. Focusing on the journey fosters acceptance. By embracing the inevitable ups and downs of life, we cultivate a sense of peace 
and equanimity. This allows us to approach challenges not with frustration, but with the understanding that they are part of the learning process that shapes us. Furthermore, prioritizing the journey cultivates gratitude. When we appreciate the present moment, the small victories and the everyday experiences, we cultivate a sense of fulfillment that goes beyond simply reaching a goal. It's about finding joy in the act of striving and growing, not just the distant end point. Remember the destination, whether success or failure, is fleeting. It's the journey itself, with all its twists and turns, that equips us with the tools to navigate life's uncertainties. By embracing the process of growth, we pave the way for a life filled with meaning, wisdom and a lasting sense of inner peace. Stoic Serenity Life inevitably throws judgment our way, but Stoicism equips us with a powerful tool, Stoic Serenity. This is a state of emotional calmness that allows you to remain unfazed by negativity and external pressures. It's about not letting the judgments of others dictate your reactions or inner peace. Imagine yourself standing amidst a raging storm. The wind howls, the rain lashes, but you stand firm, protected by a sturdy shield. Similarly, stoic serenity acts as a shield against the storms of judgment and negativity. It allows you to remain centered and composed, your inner peace unaffected by the external noise. Cultivating Stoic Serenity fosters emotional resilience. By detaching your emotions from the judgments of others, you prevent negativity from controlling your reactions. This allows you to respond thoughtfully and rationally, rather than impulsively lashing out or withdrawing in self-doubt. Furthermore, Stoic Serenity fosters self-respect. When your sense of worth isn't contingent upon the approval of others, you cultivate a deep sense of inner strength and self-confidence. This allows you to navigate life's challenges with integrity and a calm demeanor, regardless of external opinions. Build supportive relationships. Life's journey is enriched by fostering connections with those who uplift and support our growth. These supportive relationships act as a safety net a source of encouragement and a springboard for personal development. Surrounding yourself with positive individuals who celebrate your successes and offer guidance during challenges fosters a sense of belonging and self-worth. They challenge you to be your best self, providing constructive feedback and celebrating your achievements big or small. Building these supportive relationships takes intentionality and effort. Seek out individuals who share your values, inspire you, and bring out the best in you. Invest time in genuine conversations, offer support in return, and create a space for mutual growth. Remember, supportive relationships are a two-way street. Be a source of encouragement and celebrate the triumphs of those around you. By nurturing these connections, you create a network of support that empowers you to navigate life's challenges and reach your full potential. Filter your impressions. Our minds are bombarded with information constantly, shaping our perceptions and influencing our actions. However, not all information is accurate or helpful. Stoicism emphasizes the importance of filtering your impressions, a practice of critically examining our perceptions and challenging negative thoughts before allowing them to dictate our emotions and behavior. Imagine our minds as filters, responsible for sifting through the influx of impressions we encounter daily. These impressions can be external stimuli like sights, sounds or words, or internal thoughts and emotions. The filtering process involves scrutinizing these impressions, differentiating between objective facts and subjective interpretations. Often. Our interpretations are colored by past experiences, personal biases, and emotional triggers. This can lead to negative thought patterns like catastrophizing or overgeneralizing, hindering rational thinking, and leading to unnecessary suffering. By filtering our impressions, we learn to question the validity of negative thoughts. Are they based on objective reality or simply distorted perceptions? We can employ logic and evidence to challenge these thoughts, replacing negativity with more balanced and realistic perspectives. 
This process requires self-awareness and a willingness to confront our own biases. By consciously filtering our impressions, we gain greater control over our emotional responses. We can avoid being swept away by negativity and navigate life's challenges with greater clarity and resilience. Don't compare yourself to others. It's natural to look around and compare ourselves to others. Social media and societal pressures can easily fuel this tendency, leading to feelings of inadequacy and discontent. However, Stoicism encourages us to shift our focus, highlighting the importance of not comparing ourselves to others. Each individual has a unique journey, and focusing on your own path leads to greater fulfillment and personal growth. Comparing yourself to others creates a false and harmful benchmark. Every person has different starting points, resources and life experiences. Comparing your chapter 3 to someone else's chapter 20 provides an inaccurate and disheartening picture. Instead, Stoicism encourages you to embrace your own compass, identify your values, goals and aspirations. Use these as your guiding light, focusing on your personal growth and development rather than external comparisons. Focusing on your own path fosters self-acceptance. By appreciating your unique talents, strengths and experiences, you cultivate a sense of self-worth independent of external validation. This allows you to celebrate your own achievements, big or small, without feeling diminished by someone else's success. Furthermore, focusing on your own journey frees up your mental energy. When you stop comparing yourself to others, you can channel that energy into pursuing your passions, developing your skills, and contributing positively to the world in your own unique way. Remember, everyone is on their own path, navigating unique challenges and opportunities. By embracing your own compass, focusing on your personal growth and celebrating your journey, you pave the way for a more fulfilling and meaningful life. Don't let the comparisons of others dim the light that shines within you. Keep your focus, chart your course and navigate your own adventure with purpose and passion.